Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 4 of Let's Play Rough Trigger the Vanacore Conspiracy. Alright, it has been a few days since I recorded the previous episode, and I'm just catching up into what I need to do next. Now that I'm on the second planet. So it looks like I gotta find a weapon shop, and hopefully I have enough to get a new weapon. At least there are tokens here, so that helps. Sure, I'll buy some more armor. Why the hell not? So, I think this is what? Stage 7? Or is it stage 8? No, it's stage 7 now that I think about it. So, I had the city, then I had the factory, and then I had a boss. And my armor's already gotten two hits! Amazing. Two hits! Wow, I can't dodge these guys to save my life. Maybe I need to start jumping when I fight them. Oh, what? I died? I, I'm, I'm seriously dead. Wow. Easy come, easy go, right? Oh, thanks for giving me armor that I could have used a few seconds ago, or health. Ah, they have really good accuracy. This is very frustrating. Plus, I'm on my last life, so what happens if I game over? Do I retain, like, my tokens and all that stuff? And my currency? Or does it just reset from when I last saved? I don't know. That's the part that worries me. Well, I guess it's time to find out. So do they let you continue the level with a fresh set of lives? That's also what I'd like to know. Or is it to the point where it just reloads where you left off with the same number of lives? Oh, it just goes back to the title screen? Oh no! I have to continue stage 7 with only two lives! These guys actually did this! Oh, they just made this worse! Like, imagine getting to a really tough level with only one life. That means you're gonna be at one life the entire time. Oh no. Oh god, why? It resets all your progress from when you last saved. Even the tokens are reset. Hi, Ruff. Don't forget to visit Mr. Carabino's weapon shop. I'm sure he'll be very happy to meet you again. Oh, this is shitty. Yep, it reset my lives. Now, if it didn't reset the tokens... That could have been great for me to, like, just farm rank. Somehow, I don't think they had that kind of courtesy at all. I'm just gonna throw that out there. Fudge! At least they only fired three shots at a time. But it gets really bad when my auto-targeting just messes up. Oh, because I turn around a bit too much. Okay, there we go. I think I know why I was screwing up. Because I would just, like, weave back in the other direction. Hmm, what do I need this for? Is there something I need to blow up? I'm just gonna go ahead and do this anyway, even though it's not necessary. Now I have little to no ammo for this particular gun.
Okay, I gotta be a little bit smarter than this. Okay, there we go. That's that's better. I, I still wish they could let you buy ammo in this. I don't know why that's not in the game. It's like I would gladly spend extra tickles to get more ammo. Also, I wonder how the hell you get up there. It's a whole lot of rewards. Is there something I need to blow up? Or maybe I can't make it there yet. There's probably something I need to reach later on. So let's just ignore the uh, pig lots for now and come back later. Looks like I need to do some swimming. So where exactly do I need to go? Well, other than just grab some tokens and avoid these drones. Yeah, I think I just need to go over here. Okay, there's a teleporter. And a glass dome that I can't break. Do I need to just smash these? No. It looks like it's cracked. Do I need to throw... Do I need to bring the, uh... Explosive tickle or explosive pig lot, I mean to say? All the way over there? Can I hold one while swimming? I'm gonna try it. I did not think that was something I could do. Oh wow, all the bombs come back. Okay, uh, we'll, we'll try it. I know I can't double jump, but can I swim? While holding one. Wouldn't this blow up if it touches the water though? No, it just disappears! It doesn't exist! Wait, how do you get this open? There's no back door. I mean, at least there are more t Ow. Oh, there goes my armor in one explosion. Okay, there we go. Hmm. Is there a way to get in there from underwater? See cracks, but that's not what it's for. Oh, this is not very clear what I need to be doing. I seriously have no idea. Oh, jeez. These guys just infinitely respawn. That's awful. It's like they try to make, come up with every way possible to make a miserable game more miserable. I don't know how they keep doing it. But they keep finding a way. What's up with these loops, anyway? Do they even serve a purpose? They don't. That's just a highlight where you're supposed to land when you get to this planet, I guess. Come on!
Now look around here. I don't see anything that needs to be blown up. Why is this even here? Can I smash these windows too? Okay, that one can be smashed. And push the pig lots towards the teleport. Strike a smash punch. Like that? How do I get them to the other side? Oh, I can pick them up through the cage. Okay. Oh, it just walks over there. Huh. Alright. I guess that works too. You know, if it wants to. Get over there. You gotta be kidding me. I was supposed to do that? Oh, that is just lame. And let me guess, I can blow up this wall. I'm calling it. You can blow up this wall. But it looks like you're supposed to go there now. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put one right here by this wall. I knew it. Wait. Did someone try to shoot me through the other side of that wall before they even knew I was there? Huh? Well, I found two more lives, so that's a great boon. This would be so much better if every time you die, extra lives respawn. So you can use this spot to get, like, multiple lives. Because you gotta need it for this kind of BS. Yeah, this guy... These guys are shooting at you even though they didn't even know I was there. Well, I would get the tokens, but I need to stay alive. Luckily, I left some health over there. It was right here, wasn't it? Yes. Okay. Good thing I left that. Should I get more armor? I mean, I got more T-Gull, so I guess I should just buy more again. It's a little repetitive that I have to, like, restock my armor every time. could have made this so much better if they actually allowed you to buy armor. Like, even that small feature would have been a great improvement to what they actually delivered. Okay, there's some pig lots over here, too. So where's the teleporter I gotta bring him to this time? Bring him to the same one? Oh, I have to bring it to the same one. Okay. Get in there. It's pretty cool that you can actually just hit the pig lots to push them, but it doesn't, like, hurt them or anything, because they have infinite health. Oh, I'm glad they have infinite health! I was half expecting this game to actually count as two hits against me. That's how little faith I have in this. Uh oh. Oh, that's bullshit! 
How do you prepare me for that? Seriously. Like, the bomb came at me, like, in no time flat. Okay, I guess we could have used that teleporter for the pig lots. I don't think it matters what one you bring them to, does it? So I brought two piglets, piglots to the previous one. It still says there's more. So I don't think I screwed up the game by bringing two to another teleporter instead of this one. Did I? Did I softlock myself by mistake? No, I don't think I did. I really hope I didn't. I'm too afraid to find out because I'm doing so well right now. Oh, there's a whole other area. Maybe I can get into this dome. This one looks like it opens up more on the bottom. Hope it does. Please, just a crumb of rank up, please. That's all I ask. Oh yeah, you see that? That one you can get in from the water. Was that for the other dome too? I think so. Now what do I need this for? I guess to blow up this door. Yup. That just allows me to get to the other side a bit quicker. Okay, so now I can actually go to the other dome. That must be where the other pig lots are. And should disable that other barrier. Wait, that barrier is disabled now. I think? Yeah, seems like it to me. Nope, this takes me back where I started. This, this level's bad. <laughs> There's just so much rooting around just for pig lots. With mines constantly coming back. Then you have to like deal with enemies. Then you have to deal with swimming. Then you have to press some buttons. Oh, the later levels are going to be much worse. Okay, but yeah, I was correct. This is open now. Wait, there was another dome? I only saw two. Or was there a third one? Oh, y'all can come with. Hope you're good at pathfinding. Come on, go over here. Go over here. Guys, go over here. Over here. You. Oh god, they're going trying to go through the window. Oh god, their pathfinding is bad. It's just as I feared. Jeez Louise. Well, I did notice I ranked up, so... Next time I go to the shop, uh, let me see what new weapon I can buy. That did not advance anything. So, I guess I gotta go to dome number three. Alright, let's do that then. Dang it. 
Wait. Oh my lord. Get up. Thank you. Why'd you have to make that so hard? <laughs> I can't- I can hardly see much redeeming about this other than the music. Alright, Devastator. Here's a new gun. Oh, you can get level 2 armor for this? Okay. Oh, the Devastator has way more rounds. 150? Okay, that's ludicrous, but I like it. Hold on, I think I was this dome that I came from. Where's the third one, then? I'm gonna go this way and find out. That barrier's still there. Oh. Does the armor still get destroyed in two explosions? So it's all better than level one. When it comes to these things. I hear a pig lot nearby, but where? Oh. Oh, there we go. I didn't think you could break that door. Oh, no, no! Oh, that was a good dodge. There must be more in this one, too. Nope, that that's just stuff for me. Alright, come with me if you want to live. You can also help me live longer. By giving me more rank and money. Thank you. It did put away that barrier. Alright, now what? Checkpoint? Is this only my first checkpoint through the level? Wow. Okay, I guess I'll have to live with that. Hmm. I can break that, but it doesn't open from that side. Uh, how you doing, Mr. K? There's only one person who dares to call me that, but I don't see him often. Hey, what are you doing here? How's the hero business? Eh, uh, not so bad, but this mission that was supposed to be a walk in the park is getting slightly complicated. Thanks to a nutcase mutant called Armageddon. Sorry to hear that. About your buddy Armageddon, word on the street, he keeps a low profile in that warehouse next to the one that exploded a couple of days ago. I'll make a note. Got something to show you. Nice, huh? Wow. Where'd you find that? Some old antique dealer? I got something. Not too far from the weapon shop, behind a grating, you'll find a pass to that warehouse. Cool. I know because I hid it there. <laughs> Excellent! You're the man! That I am. But it's going to take some doing. You'll have to find a way of sneaking through the narrow twists of the air conditioning system. But I'm sure you'll manage. Mm. If you're looking for help, I got new stuff in, crying out for a guy like you. What kind of new stuff? Can you make the shop sell ammo? No, it just gets me to recharge my armor. So this stuff's all the same. Look at you, all dressed up and nowhere to go. <laughs> okay, Ralph, what you got there is a smart piglot. 
This critter can slip through narrow passages and fetch all kinds of objects if you need it to. Huh. So before you teleport it, find out if you can put it to use. Good luck. Oh, another pig lot I need to pick up and bring somewhere. Where have I seen that before? Hold on, I think I got an idea. I can put it in here. That's narrow. I can't fit through there, but this pig lot sure as hell can. There, I got the key card to the warehouse. I did it. It has been done. So what kind of bullets does the Devastator use? Like regular bullets like my pea shooter? Hmm, looks like it to me. It just has a much larger capacity. I greatly appreciate. Oh, hi. Oh, it does more damage! And it also shoots faster. The only problem, of course, is the ammo is going to go away faster, too. Which is usually par for the course. Oh, that's right, you can shoot these from up here. Okay, they, they don't share the same uh, bullets. Well, I guess I can use the pea shooter for, like, the, uh, the standard, like, like, little minions that can probably die in a couple of hits. And then use the Devastator for, like, the bigger mobs. That might be a good idea. Hold on, is this Domari open? Looks like it already is open. Yeah, I can get in there now. Okay. That works. This is not a place I've already been to, was it? Because it looks very identical. These things do not come back, do they? I hope not. Come on. Come on. Come with me. Come on. It really takes, like, some elements from Pikmin. But at least Pikmin were useful. Like, some of these are useful, but only in limited capacity. And you might only find one or one of those at a time. After that ain't useful anymore. Just a lot of the generic ones. Yeah, so maybe those, uh, flying creatures do come back. No, no, okay. Looks like I just gotta go over here. Where am I in this level? Pretty much midway. I'm only midway now? That's absurd. Oh. Armor's already gone. Damn. Doesn't feel like level 2 when you think about it. But it is level 2. 
So I have to take the game's word for it. That's only 300, so that's not even bad. I can honestly say, you probably won't run out of money. Like, that's only the one redeeming thing about it. It's difficult to run out of money. Ooh. Is it worth my ball to go here? Can I do anything over here in this spot? I'm gonna go look. That one doesn't have anything. Can't get up there. What about any of these beachheads? Hmm. Doesn't have much. Oh, wait, wait. That has an extra life. I take it back. It does have value. What's the most amount of lives you can carry? So I see it's in double digits. Maybe it like goes up to 99, if you were lucky enough to find that many at a time. Or maybe it's just low and say, like, oh, okay, no, you only get 10. Sorry. <laughs> you figure it out how to get through the rest of this game. Oh, that's where you put the key card. Oh, you again. All right, Armageddon, let's dance one more time. I did it. I didn't even need to switch to my Devastator. This guy's a joke. Oh, but he left something. Hello, Ruff. Do you need help? Or just me? Mr. End of the World here just hightailed it out. Is he coming up on the radar? Yeah, just a second. He's making his way to one of the elevators leading to the submarine structures. Thanks, sweetheart. How about dinner? Let's say nine? Just get yourself out in one piece, rough stuff. And then we'll see. Oh, that is so lame. Oh, more green liquid. I'll drink it all. Oh, so I got a new ability that summons, what, lightning? Or is that a storm? You got the storm genetic power. Okay. Man, I've really been neglecting uh, using the werewolf ability for some time. Just never saw I need to hold on to it. You know? So there's just pig lots around here, but I don't see any. Hold on, which way am I going? Okay, I have been through here. They said going around the sub pen. Is this the way to get to it? Oh, oh, what? Oh. Thought I saw what looked like an entrance. They said go to the elevators. But where is that? And there's no way to, like, get a waypoint or anything. It's like, okay, we can show you where you are, but that's all. Those other things that can help you, like, where you might need to go, oh, no, we can't do that. Wait! Did that animal crate come back? 
this tile over here, I guess, respawns ammo crates. Bye. Now, if only it respawned the ammo you'll want. Wait, did he just keel over? I thought that last shot missed. Okay, maybe now I should start using the werewolf more often. Save my ammo, I guess. Okay, the werewolf looks really cool on level 2 armor. Like, if it could be cool in anything, it's at least the level 2 armor. Oh my god. Yeah, it's all gone! Oh, this only goes around you? Well, that's lame. When was the last time I got Devastator armor? I don't even remember. Has it ever happened? Have I gone the whole game without picking up this kind of ammo? Because that's ludicrous, but also on brand. Here's a great gun. Oh, you never get ammo for it ever again. Sorry. Wait, that's just where I came from. Is the game telling me I need to stand on this? Ah, oh, damn it. Wait, I can still get over there. I kind of want to kill this guy first. He adjusted his aim in midair. Wow. Like he knew to just shoot up right away. Okay. Oh, well, that was my fault. You gotta be joking me. I've never picked up Devastator armor or... Devastator ammo the whole game. What is this game thinking? Why give you a gun if it gives you no ammo? This is just miserable. Am I really going to have to use the launcher? Guess I'm gonna have to use the launcher. Now let's do this. These guys are gonna have my last nerve. This will not hit the barricade, will it? Okay, it goes through the barricade. Well, that's one way to do it. Oh, I was supposed to cross by just killing these guys from a distance. What if I didn't have the right gun for it? What if I just ran out of ammo? Like, okay, well, sorry, but you, uh, you're out of luck. Huh. Yep, thanks. Also, I hate these werewolf powers for the sole reason that you have to stand perfectly still to use them. So because of that, I'm more likely to get myself killed because I have to aim the shots. And charging it means there's another bullet coming my way. Alright, now what do I do?
There's too many bullets. There's too many enemies on that one side. But it looks like I need to get over there. The question is, how do I do it? Oh, I only got one bullet, so... Might as well make it useful, I guess. It's just one last thing to shoot at me. Oh wow, did I actually get Devastator ammo? Does that exist? It actually does! I finally got ammo for this Forsaken Gun. Now how the hell do I get over there? Can't jump on the rocks, that would have been very helpful. And I'm at half health already, well, less than half health. Okay, well, with less enemies shooting at me at one time, maybe I can start finding a way to get up there. Is there a ledge? I thought that was a ledge. It's not. Hey, how do you get up there? Nope, that rock, you just slide right off. Oh my god. I'll be surprised if I even make it through the whole game. I'm not even kidding. I can't aim at this guy from anywhere! He's too far! Am I gonna have to blind aim? This sucks! Where the frick do I go? Here? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Like, if there was a way to just aim while I'm in first-person mode, that would make things a lot better, but there's no way. There's so many ways we can do this, and the game gives you none of them. Was I really supposed to do this, or is this just the awkward way of doing it? If there was a way that I should have done and I missed it, I'm going to feel like an idiot. But if there was no other way, then that's just awful. Yeah, like, jump in midair just to keep shooting. Well, I don't know what else is over there, but it looks like I skipped it. I guess it's a long way down. Darn it, this is all I need. Come on, Ruff, let's get out of here. Why are you talking like that? You're Ruff. Wait, there was 98 enemies? Was each mine, like, an extra enemy, even though I already killed it? And every time it keeps coming back, it adds one more? I think that's what the game is saying. <laughs> 
Because there's no way I killed exactly 98 enemies in one level. That is a bit much. Alright, so this must be stage 8. Okay, so at least I know that if I'm going through a level and I lose too many lives early, I can just quit and reload. And that way I'll retain my lives. So that's kind of helpful. You know, if I can get, get one little bit of solace out of this. This took well over 40 minutes to finish one stage. It's not looking well for the rest of the game. So let's stop here, and in the next parts, we'll be going through what looks like an underground cave. Alright guys, see you in the next part.